The iconic Israeli Opera House has been sitting empty for the first time in over 30 years. But a group of celebrated artists from several areas of the arts and culture world are making a lot of noise, even in the form of a silent protest. I have no comfort because we don't have future. We don't have a deadline. There is no date. And even if there is, it's very vague. Sahar Azimi and his impressive group of fellow artists have decided to literally sleep on the stage floor of four of Tel Aviv's cultural halls as part of Operation Protective Edge. Everybody knows that culture is out of business for around eight months already. Uh, around 150,000 people dealing with the culture industry, industry are out of work. Revital Ben Asher Peretz is the art consultant for the city of Tel Aviv, but has been moonlighting with her Protective Edge co-creators for several years with what they call peaceful military artistic operations. We were thinking about um, a very quiet and basic and uh, preliminary uh, action of uh, a way to, to protest perhaps and, and, and speak out loudly. And the quietest thing that we could think of is uh, going to sleep. With cameras and streaming, viewers are transported into the boredom, sadness and existential emptiness that we're all feeling as a result of the coronavirus on all aspects aspects of society. It's like a uh, zeitgeist in a way that it is the right moment to speak about uh, the fact that everything is closed. This idea to make it a sleeping place, it's, it's, it was so uh, amazing. Nira Yitzaki is the owner of Tel Aviv's Shlush Gallery and represents this group of artists. Well, uh, first of all, we are sharing, I think, the, sad of, uh, the, the feeling of sadness and to make like a more movement of sleeping because it has such a power image that what I want is that people will notice. And all of the artists and crew are working for free, but are only cautiously hopeful the show will go on in the near future. But I just, I'm just here to reflect what I see. And what I see is something which is really sleeping to the end of times. Is how do you develop without the audience, without the, the, this dialogue? How do you, how do you create? Whom to? To Zoom? At the Israeli Opera, Emily Francis, I-24 News.